I'm Helge Pedersen, and this is uh, my new BMW R1200GS Adventure. Red color, wonderful bike. I'm heading down to Argentina and Tierra del Fuego. It's about three months trip. At the end of March uh, 2010, I will be there. When I buy stuff, I want to buy from somebody that test it out that go out riding themselves. And there are many good companies out there, but I, I know that uh, up through the years, I've seen the new things come out from TourAttack. I know every time I get it, it's good quality. So I feel very comfortable now when I outfitted my bike, it's gonna hold up. Some of my favorite TourAttack uh, items is, it probably go towards the practical. Definitely the Sega Pros. Aluminum panniers is my favorite, and these brand new Sega Pro panniers is the best ever. So one of the most important things I think that I've done to this bike is put a really strong uh, protector under the engine, a soft plate here, and I also extended it onto the center stand. My GPS mount, have to have it. Can't live without it. You have to have a GPS. I got it out of the center. I can look at my instruments there and it's a lockable one and it's just great. Other things I put on, as you see, we'll see many places, these ram mounts, because I'm going to do a lot of filming on this trip. A ram mount here, a ram mount on the side. The R1200GS Adventure is made for carrying tons of camera equipment and uh, camping gear and all the good stuff that I love when I go. I don't like to go any place without taking my cameras and now also video camera because I want to make a documentary about this tour. So it's going to be a challenge in many ways, but uh, I've taken away the back seat and I put it on a huge camera bag. So it's going to weigh a ton, and, but it's going to be a very good bike to travel with because I have all my gear with me. So no, it's no more excuses for not getting some good documentary stuff. I think one of the reasons that uh, people get hooked on uh, motorcycle adventure touring is the freedom. Just feeling the weather, feeling the wind, the smells, and people always strike up a conversation. You get out of town and some old guy will come up and say, yeah, I used to have one of those. And you get the stories going and the camaraderie and stuff is just fantastic. Since I'm gonna do a lot of off-road riding, I decided to put on this part here because if I hit the rock and it goes like bang, like this, uh, it will hit the rubber here and that's just more forgiving and uh, hopefully nothing uh, will go wrong. When I'm going down the road in, uh, on the way to Tierra del Fuego, a lot of rocks are going to be flying through the air from my friends, so cars I meet, you need to protect your oil cooler. You don't want to puncture your oil cooler. This is very fragile. It's the fuel injectors, and just having that protection there, if my skin, if my leg come forward there and hit it, it will just repel off there. On the other side, I have even the throttle body there, the butterfly thing. It's an electronic sensor protector, but this is good protection. There's another protection for the brake, the pump here, when I'm pumping here, that's, you need brakes, it's important. I also chose to put a little bigger footprint on my brake. I, th I feel it's a little small, so, put that little extender there. A couple of things I've done here is the side stand. This is a big heavy bike. A lot of weight is gonna rest on this guy here. And I feel that the original footprint is too small, so I put on this plate here. I took off the gear shifter from the original one from BMW and put on the TourTech one. It has a couple of good, good features. You can uh, change the distance here, custom make it to your own. I found my own length, that's so it hit just the toe, the right place on my boot, and it also will uh, go backward like this. It's a small details, but it's really important because think about how many times you use that on a daily basis uh, when you're riding. If you just sit at home and read the newspapers, watch TV and learn about the world that way, you're depriving yourself of the tremendous experience you could have had by going to the different cultures, and especially on a motorcycle. You can come to these out-of-the-way tourist places. And it's really a good, best way of traveling.